We're rolling, and this time, it's gonna be great. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be the best day of our life. It's gonna be the best day of our life. <laughs> you moron. This hair is gonna get cropped out probably. There's not gonna be room enough because I'm gonna have to cut that off. You better turn your air conditioner off. Cause it's gonna make noise. It's gonna mess with your soundtrack. Oh my god. Turn off! I had something to talk about. I don't know what it is. That's great. A lot of people are going to click on A lot of people are going to watch this. Yeah. It's going to be a video in which I have nothing to say. But I have two cameras to say nothing into. Oh, fancy. We're just going to sit here. I'm just going to pray that the Spirit of the Lord will come to me and she will give me beautiful, nice things to say. Birds. Let's talk about birds. I have nothing against you birds, but you can't live in my porch. I don't appreciate it. My house already looks busted enough from the outside. It's not nice. You birds need to leave. Do you ever just feel like fucking stupid? I just, I don't know. I got nothing. But I look pretty. Oh, I'm so pretty. I feel so pretty. Oh. Hello. All right. Uh, today's topic is shopping. I've got a random website here pulled up with some disgusting questions, and uh, and we're gonna get right to it. Okay. We're just gonna get right to it. It's a drag queen in front of a green screen. No one's ever done that before. Totally not a ripoff. <laughs> okay. All right. First question about shopping. I forgot what the question is. Do you enjoy shopping? Why or why not? I do love to shop, but it, it definitely depends on the situation. It definitely depends on the situation. Uh, because if I go to Walmart at 3 o'clock, 3... <laughs> If I go to Walmart at 3 o'clock in the afternoon, I can guarantee you that's going to trigger, um, first of all, road rage getting there. I'm going to scream and yell and curse um, on the road to get there. <laughs> and then when I get there, I'm already going to be pissed off. Um, it's going to be hot. Well, right now, anyway, because it's July. It's going to be hot as f outside. There's going to be a million stupid ass people in there. You know how they always say that people from the South are real nice? Just so polite and so sweet? Well, they are, except when they're shopping at Walmart or at Kroger. And that's the time that they get real nasty and real rude and they won't get the f out of your way! Um, yeah, see... I swear to God, it happens every time. It happens every time. I go, there's something I need, and there's either one of two things. There's somebody just happened to be standing right the f in front of it, nobody else in the aisle, but there's a person just right in front of what I need, and they're not going to move with any expediency. That's number one. Number two, it's going to be just a big cluster f full of people in the middle of the aisle, and they're just chatting it up and just... Hi, honey, I haven't seen you since church meeting last Tuesday night. Get Mildred's cancer came back. We're going there to the Bass Pro Shop. Am I a hateful person? Bam! Just like that. That's all there is to it, Dustin. That's all there is to it. Mm, I'm kinda hateful. <sighs> kinda hateful. Third Next question, please. What is your favorite shop and why? My favorite shop is the Goodwill. Now I know a lot of people hate the Goodwill. Um 
for their shady ass business practices, and that is completely accurate. Uh, they mark some of that shit way up. Uh, they're supposed to be a charity. They're not really a charity. They're making a profit. It's not good. Um, but whatever. That's where I get all my drag, and uh, that's where my mama taught me to shop. So, this, you can blame her. Well, partially. Uh, there's, a, there's a lot of factors that went into this. <laughs> but uh, as for finding, as for finding my tasteful ensemble on sale, um, you can blame my mother. She taught me to go straight to the clearance rack at any given store, and it pays off. But I'm not an expensive bitch. I don't need that. Who needs that? I got more important things to spend money on, like stupid shit from Amazon. At least I stopped buying DVDs. Y'all still buying DVDs? Probably not. I don't think anybody is. Remember the good old days when you go to Best Buy and buy a bunch of DVDs you didn't need? Ah, and then streaming services came in. We got Netflix and Hulu and Amazon, and then that just, well, that just sort of fell by the wayside. So the DVD industry burned brightly. It's, uh, it's pretty much dead though. But you know what? We might have to go back to it because Every media company now wants to start their own streaming service and yank all of the good shit off of Amazon, Hulu, and Netflix and put it on their own platform that you're going to have to pay extra for. They're fixing to put that up. They're going to take it away. So, I don't know, guys. Don't do it. I would advise you not to do it, please. But the uh, wheels are in motion, and I'm sure it's uh, it's too late. Just like it's, uh, it's too late for all of us. We're all going to die... Mm, we're all gonna die someday old and crippled up and alone and nobody's gonna remember your name or what you did sweet lady death she's coming for all of us her hands are cold and they're coming for you what the f all right next question in your city what is a good place to go shopping uh, well, let's see. Uh, I have kind of a circuit. There's a Goodwill over there. There's a Salvation Army over there. There's a Goodwill over there. There's antique stores down there. And now the rest of the video will just consist of me making stupid noises. Hey, hey, because that's that's what you want to see, right? <laughs> give me give me money on Patreon, and then I'll give you extra footage all the time of just you can ex you can get that exclusively on my Patreon for five hundred dollars a month. Pay my mortgage, and I swear to God, I'll give you a video every three days that's just see see that's nice. See that's what everybody's doing now. They're doing exclusive creator content and Patreon, and they're all quitting their day jobs to make podcasts. And and I'm just I'm just left behind. I'm just left behind some sad old psycho shit working at Party City because I wasn't smart enough to start a podcast. <laughs> How do you feel about online shopping? Oh, 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 I like to shop. See, uh, I left out part of the uh, part of the shopping equation talking about Goodwill uh, and Salvation Army uh, because I get most of my drag from there. But really, where I get my essential tools is going to be Amazon, and I think that's pretty much every drag queen these days. Um, can you imagine what they did before Amazon? What did you do? Where did you get body suits? Uh, wh where did you get? This clown makeup, where did you get, um, these nails, the gloves, what did you do? Goodwill, Salvation Army, and Amazon. And I'm sorry, those are all evil companies, and I fully admit that. Amazon, is, oh, Amazon's bad. Amazon's bad, we're all feeding the beast. What are we gonna do? I need bodysuits and shoes. Oh, shoes, where did y'all get shoes that fit you before Amazon? What did, what did you do? What did you do? I don't know. What do you think shopping will be like in the future? I I don't know. Um, I will probably some kind of brain implant, Skynet, importing all preferences from home interface, Borg assimilation with our bodies and our minds and our whole lives with technology. Look, it's happened. It's already happened. It's too late. Just don't don't become a zombie. Don't stop thinking. Don't stop asking questions. 
and for fuck's sake, vote. We've all been so apathetic, but we can't do that anymore. We can't do it. I know times are scary. Nobody likes Trump, unless you're a monstrous, horrible, dumbass person. Sorry about it. No, I'm not sorry about it. I'm not sorry about it. And you know, if you're watching this video, then uh, you probably agree with me anyway. Uh, so I'm not gonna. I ain't gonna worry about that. You dumbass. <laughs> I love you. Stay positive. We can do this. We can beat them. Just for one day. No, we can beat them permanently. No, David Bowie. We can beat them for more than one day. If you get out and you vote and you keep your mind open and you ask questions, never stop asking questions. Question authority. That I'm proud to be an American. <laughs> That's probably going to be it for today. I do really appreciate you clicking on this video. And uh, I hope you had a good time watching me. And uh, please stay tuned for more videos. I would really like to put one of these out every week. Uh, well, I we'll see how that goes. Um, and if you don't like the shit that I'm saying, then well, you can at least uh, you can at least look at what I have on and be satisfied. Hopefully. Anyway, my name's Greta Garbage. Uh, I love you all very much, and uh, have a great day. Bye. Bye now. <laughs>